Hey, we are back. Yes. Um, I'm actually going to be playing uh, Overwatch Season 7 for the first time on console. Um, so, yeah, so that's going to be nice. Um, there might be some, not just Season 7 stuff, like um, all the Halloween event. Uh, there might be some Halloween stuff, and there might also be, like, standard games, shall we say. Um, yeah, so, it's going to be fun. Um, for some reason, I don't hear any game audio. Um... Yeah, I don't, I don't hear any game audio. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Uh, my Xbox just... Here, let me see if I turn up my, my speakers. And the track here. Ah, there we go. Uh, if I do this first, go into options, uh, music volume, there you go. That's what I needed to mute, um, uh, because of copyright and all that. Um, back that out. Uh, wait, do I have, uh, social friends only? On, uh, hide my name on. Okay, accessibility, uh, subtitles. Sure, that's fine. Eh, 20 is fine. That's fine. Um,. That's all fine. Uh, that's fine. Okay, cool. Um, I'm just making sure everything is set the way that I want it to be. Controls, uh, interface, endorses right uh, right thumbstick, um, comms, that's all fine. Um, thanks is that, uh, spectate, that's fine, uh, sound is all fine, uh, except, yeah, that's, that's fine, uh, voice chat, uh, off, off, I don't want to join, uh, voice chat, off, that's fine, video, that's fine, details, sure, that's fine, there we go, um, so before we actually jump in, I do want to talk Oh geez, that's a little loud now. Um, I do want to talk about um, skins and stuff like that, and sort of talk about some of my favorites that I have. Um, and obviously, we're we're starting off with Diva because obviously I, I played a crap ton of her back in uh, um, the original. Um, I do have obviously her. Her Halloween one, which I've just equipped. So, yeah. And this skin, by the way, was stupidly expensive. I think it was like 700 I think. Or it could have been more than that. I think it might have been more than, more than that. Give me a second here to... Um, uh, if I do... I can do it this way. Uh, there you go. 
I think I can do it this way. Uh, should automatically log me in. Uh, hopefully. Why isn't it lo not logging me in? Anyways, it doesn't really matter. I it was expensive. I think it was like... It was... There we go. I went the wrong way through. <laughs> I went to the Overwatch website and said through Blizzard. Um, so... Um, ba -ba -ba. This is what I want. Um... And then I need my phone. Uh, give me a sec here. I'm, I'm oh, actually, I don't need my phone because I thought uh, due to two-factor two uh, authentication. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, so this skin right here, the, the her Halloween one, the Shin Ryong one, was a thousand five hundred credits. Um, her Infinite uh, Ace one from the uh, from season six was uh, seven fifty, and then I I decided to finally buy. Ramada because I had enough credits because they gave uh, 3,000 at the beginning um, of season 7 which was very very nice of them they didn't have to do that so obviously I appreciate it um, so I could buy Ramada um, so the only hero that I'm missing is Life Weaver which is obviously the last support that just came out so I do have Ramada now um, and he was expensive he was 900 credits um, so yeah, I spent probably close to 3,000, like 20, actually I can do the math. Um, give me a sec here. So one plus 900 plus 750. Yeah, I spent 31, so 3,150 credits on, uh, those three, well, one character and two skins. Which you might think is quite stupid, but um, I wanted, um, where is it here? I've wanted um, this skin for, for quite some time, um, as well as her um, Infinite Ace one from last, uh, from last season, which looks really, really nice. I, I actually do like it. Um, I would say it's one of her better skins, um, but I, I do have a fair bit of skins. Obviously, I do have obviously the the EDM, which was part of season one, um, which which I used quite a fair bit. Um, and then obviously I have a lot of the other ones. Like I have the Midnight one, which is a nice one. And then all these ones are the Overwatch uh, League skins. Um, but I don't have a lot for Ramada, obviously, because I just literally grabbed him and all of his skins are like 300 on the cheapest so yeah so i'm not going to really worry about him um but if i go into yeah mercy here for a second i don't play a lot of mercy at all um i play a lot of Kiriko, but um over the last little bit um i ended up watching the the contenders so i do have the uh the overwatch contenders away skin as well as the home skin which looks very very close shall we say to the um Uh, Houston Outlaws, um, Mercy skin, like, v we're talking pretty close, like, and obviously, um, 
each of these skins are 150 but you get both home and away um so yeah so as you can see i do own all of them except for life weaver um which is fine um i don't really care there there you can see there's the infinite ace uh one it was like 750 or something like that or no sorry I think it was like a thousand or something. But I'm just like, yeah, whatever. I wanted it. Um, yeah. So, am I going by the seasons past this this season? Eh, not really. Um, it would be nice to get some of the stuff, but I don't really care. Um, so. Uh, before we jump into anything, I'm just going to jump into um, an AI game uh, just to just to warm up, considering it has been um, um, it's been a while since I played on console. I primarily play um, I primarily play PC. Um, primarily for Overwatch. I don't think I've ever played this map. Uh, Diva. Oh, okay. We already have a Diva. Okay. Uh, so I guess I'll play Kiriko then. Which is fine. I, I don't mind, uh, playing Kiriko. Uh, oh wait. Uh, what was... I can't remember what, uh, options, what, um... Oh, okay. Uh. Uh, emote. Ah, back. Oh God, I can't. For some reason, I can't. Everybody, come over here. On my way. Ooh. For some reason, I. Can't. Oh god. Oh wow, I'm su Ah, dang it. Um like I said, it's been it's been quite a while since I've actually played on uh on console. Wait, what was jump again? For some reason, I thought I ha I think my uh, keybinds are all screwed. Normally I would be able to jump up on that, but I guess I can't.
Oh god. Yeah. Fair enough. I, I might have to uh, reset my controls. Oh. oh. Yay! Just got to level five. Um, so, um, let's wipe this out just so then. I'm hoping to. Oops, sorry. Uh,. I'm hoping to get to this skin soon, uh, the Lucio, because that's actually a pretty nice skin, actually, for Lucio. Mm -hmm. So if we take a look here, uh, which is, so it's 100 credits plus um, that victory pose, so not great, but decent enough, I would say. Um, That's not bad. Like I said, I, I don't have the bow pass yet, like the the premium. I would like to, but I don't really care. Um. So, anyways, uh, let's jump into. I guess this, and then we will do uh, Trials of Sanctuary. Or wait, what is this? Uh, Junk and Sun's Revenge. Uh, if I look at my challenges, let me see what challenges I have to do. Either weekly, okay, so win a game. 
Okay, so it's all that sort of stuff. Weekly. Um, okay. Earn eight progressions. Season. Event. Okay, so... Hmm. I have to do Trials of Sanctuary on hard. Legendary. So, when six, complete 16 games. Wins. Okay, so... It doesn't really matter. Okay, so... Twenty days left. Okay. Oh, wait, what did it say about challenges? Oh, active hero. Okay. Uh, so let's do this. That. We're just going to do it on on normal because I did try to do it on hard with a couple of my buddies, and it is ridiculous. It is literally ridiculously hard. Um, we did... Um, I'm going to mute myself and I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. I wanted to uh, show the um, intro. Oh, why can't I? Okay. The only thing that's saying about uh, behind my name is uh, slay uh, slay demons. That's ah, god dang it. Uh, I'm gonna. Oh, I'm blocking kill feed. Okay.
There you go. That should be. Yeah, I have to um I have to rebind my my uh, my controller. Because uh, A is normally jump and it's pulling up um It's uh pulling up um
Okay, so now we have to defeat this guy, and then it's 200 after him, and then we're done. Oh, I, I missed. Oh, how the heck did that was just yeah so now we have to do 200 and then we have to defeat Lilith like I said for some reason I I'm I have to I have to change some keybinds because Because it's so weird like A is normally jump for me maybe Maybe something got screwed up with uh, trying to connect this to PC maybe So that's my only thought. Ah, oh, god dang it. Oh. 
Oh, god dang it. How the heck did I die there? I don't play a lot of Pharah anymore, unfortunately. I used to play a lot of her back in the original version of Overwatch, but ever since it, the sequel came out, I've been playing a lot more D.Va and a lot more Kiriko. So, I'm not playing as well as I used to for, uh, of, as Pharah. Ah, oh, god dang it. So, which is unfortunate because I, I do like Farah and all of her backstory and everything, but. But unfortunately, uh, it's just not. And with these controls too, it's, these might just be the controls, I guess. So oh, we're at 135 out of 200 as you can see at the top. I know you're probably yelling at me in the comments to use my alt, but I'm going to... S I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it for Lilith. Thank you, Ryan.
So that's basically all you have to do for this one. Huh! I did get plenty of game. Wow. Oh, it was this? Ah. I wouldn't consider that play of the game, but hey, I'm going to take it. Ah, oh, almost two stars. Okay, fair enough. Yes, level up, progression level seven. Wait, hold on. Oh, complete 16 games. I got my daily done. I have to complete 24 games. I have to complete 32. Okay, uh, three out of four. Oh, earn eight progressions. Okay, so I have six out of eight. Uh Okay. Back close back out back out. Uh and then I need to go into settings uh options uh, there's one here that I need to, uh, to, uh, uh, jump into. Where was it here? Uh, here it was, I think it was under controls, I think, or where was it? It was under off. There we go. It's weird that it's saying R A H whatever. It could uh, it could just be a weird um, thing. So I'm going to go back into here for a second and make sure. Oh, I know where it is under. <laughs> uh, bu -bu 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 it's under. Yeah, it was under streamer mode. <laughs> That's where it was under. It was under streamer mode. Right, it was under streamer mode. <laughs> there you go. Um, so if we go into Battle Pass here, I'll show you... Oh, wait, no. Wait. Oh. How close am I to level 6? Or 7, I guess. Okay, so I have another about 2,500, I would say. Okay, I would like to get to level 10 by tonight, that's for sure. Is that possible? Uh, we'll see. Um, if I go into challenges here, I want to see what challenges I have uh, for the event. Okay, so I have 9 out of 12, so I just have to keep doing that. Um... So I'm almost halfway done in terms of the overall challenges. Um, I have 10 out of 21, so I have about what, 11 left, I think, if my math is correct. Um,
Uh, yes. I I did do my math correctly. Um, I don't really care about like that one's going to be fun to do, but it's going to be a pain in the ass. Um, that one's going to be somewhat easy-ish. That's going to be a pain in the ass. Uh, that's going to be a pain in the ass. That's a pain in the ass. That's not bad. That's going to be a pain. So these four right here and this here, these five, are going to be a pain in the ass. Um, that's not going to be too bad to do. That's not going to be too bad to do. That's just going to take a bit of time. That's going to take a bit of time. Uh, that one's going to take a bit of time. That one I did yesterday. Um, Trickster's Treat. Um, and that was just the... Uh, weapon charm, which I can show you what the weapon charm looks like. Again, I'll just show you it on uh, D.Va, just because that's who I'm using right now. Uh, oops, sorry, wrong one. Uh, weapon charms, here we are. Um, I'm using the Earth Day one uh, for right now. I should really use the jack o lantern considering it's Halloween. Um, I don't even remember getting that, that's for sure. Um, this is from Season 1. Or, yeah, season one. Same with same with that one. I perfected the... So there's the enraged uh, mask. Unlocked by completing the Light's Blessing Challenge from the Halloween Terror Event. Wolf Pop. Unlocked by completing Trickster's Treat Challenge. Uh, Mitzi. That's not bad. Bl uh, Blackwatch. That's a nice logo, actually. Uh, donuts not bad and then the overwatch logo and stuff like that. I don't really I would love to get the Pachamari uh, Which speaking of Pachamari uh, Let me grab this for a second here Oh, actually, let me just do this uh, I should really have another setting just for camera. <laughs> Give me a second here. So, as you guys may or may not know, I, with me working, I'm actually off today, hence why I'm recording. Um, I, um, early June, I guess? Late May, early June, I actually, um, ordered, um, a 3D printer. Um, and so, one of the things I printed recently, within the last, I would say, month or so, is a 50% scale Pachamari. Obviously, it's not painted yet. Um, this one's not perfect. Um, I'm still dialing in some settings and stuff like that. Um, I think I'm printing a little bit too hot um, in terms of the um, printing material because it's starting to actually burn a little bit. So I might try to lower it because I'm printing it around 200 C, which is a little bit too hot. Um, according to the box, um, it's saying that it should be around 190 to like to something and it's at like 200 so i'm like uh if i lower it to like let's say 290 or sorry 190 um it should not burn so i might have to lower it um and you might be wondering what filament i'm using i'm just using the any cubic uh filament um there are other ones that i am looking at like i am looking at um protopasta and others um, but for right now, I just bought another set of um, any cubic uh, filament. I bought their their purple and their uh, slick or slick or no silk uh, rainbow. So it's basically multicolored. Um, so I'm going to be printing with some of that uh, in the next little bit. Um, but yeah, like I said, um, I have a lot of. Like, I could buy any of these ones if I really wanted to, but do I really care? The rip is not bad. I do like it. If it wasn't um, 200, I would probably consider buying it. Um, but, yeah. Um, I, to prove that I actually finished uh, the um, Season 1 Battle Pass... Uh, if I go here, name cards, uh, 
owned. So I'm using the Howling Terror um, name card right now. There's the Overwatch League one. Here's the Battle Pass from Season 1. That's all Season 1 stuff right there for the Battle Pass. And then here's more Season 1 stuff. All the Pride stuff. I did use um, this one for a bit. Um, I do like that one. Um, so yeah, I have a lot of like name cards. Um, or sorry, player icons, which is... There you go. If I go owned, yeah, I have a lot of ones that, um, there's the Overwatch Dark, the Light, the the Rainbow, Anubis, Hog Hogamari, Patrimay, which is the May Patrimari, and then obviously I have the Summer Games one from 2023, so this year's, uh, Water Polo, Bowling, uh, Cabana, which is, I can't remember whose skin that is, the Ukraine, uh, Germany, Mexico, Canada, German, uh, not, uh, Summer Games 2017, 2018, Halloween Terror 2018, 2020, and last year's. Uh, Winter Wonderland, I got 2022s, so last year's and uh, 23s. Lunar New Year, uh, 2018, 2019, and 2023. Archives, 2019 and 2020s. And then we get into the anniversary stuff. We got this one, Black Cat, which is, I think, Widows, I think? I have to look that one up. Uh, Funky, which is I think is Lucio, I think. Reaper. Um, that one is um, Farah, I think. Diva. Uh, anniversary 2017, um, which is actually when I bought the game, actually. Um, I've, I've had this game since 2017. Uh, 2020, 2023, and then competitive season 36, which I literally got during the last little bit of the original game. I did end up getting to level 25. There's actually, if you look back at the channel, um, I did a, a whole video. Uh, there's a whole video um, on... Um, on getting, I think it was like two or three videos, um, where I grinded out to get to, t uh, level 25, so then I could actually play competitive right before the season, before, um, it switched over to, um, Overwatch 2, so very, very happy I did get into competitive Overwatch League, all the Overwatch League stuff. Um, I should really be using the Florida Mayhem, uh, player icon, uh, right now because they just won the Overwatch League, um, tournament the final um not that long ago um i did that when uh dallas won uh last year but right now obviously it being the uh halloween event i'm using obviously a, a halloween icon um obviously the blizzard stuff i got the monk the you are not prepared one the special one so i got the founder uh comic book for tracer lovely lovely mercy which is from the Valentine's Day event um, that they ran. So I have the Mercy, the Hanzo, and the Genji. And then obviously the Esports, the Pachamari Victory, which is awesome. I'm very, very happy I got that one. And then obviously the Contenders, and then the Battle Pass from Season 1, the Cyber Mari, which I have used in the past as well. This is all the icons from uh, Season 1's Battle Pass. The EDM uh, Diva uh, um, icon is actually one of my favorite ones. And then we have all the pride ones. I ended up, I think, using this one at one point. Or one of these. I ended up using one of these ones. I can't remember. Season 6, so I got the Null Trooper and the P900 Warhead. Because I ended up actually buying the Battle Pass uh, for Season 6. And then here's all the progression ones as well. So I have the couple Diva ones. There's the Diva, there's the Bunny, the Kiriko, um, the Mercy... Here we have season seven. This one I actually got from um, watching um, a Twitch stream, actually. Or was it this one? I can't remember. It was one of these ones. Um, and then we got Halloween Terror of this year. 
um, player titles. I, um, I don't have a lot of player titles. Um, as you can see, if I go here, go owned, I only have the Genji piece and Mercy's Angel. I'm using Mercy's Angel right now, which is kind of ironic. Um, so yeah, so if I go back into career here, um, and go into heroes, uh, where is it here? Wow. Yeah, I've played a lot of, um, oh, oh, events is only at level one, almost level two. Um, if I go stats here, yeah, it's saying I've played for 20 hours, which, uh, is not, oh, that's a quick play. If I go all modes, yeah, I've played for about 60 hours. Um, I have not that bad of a win-loss, but... Uh, not that great of a win-loss, I should say. So, I can tell you what that is. Uh, win-loss calculator. Um, number of wins. Uh, 330. Number of losses. 220 uh, 0 I have a 60% win rate overall which is not too bad like if I go into diva for example I have a 64% win rate with diva Like, I've only lost 120 games with D.Va, which is not that bad. Um, but if I go into um, Kiriko, for example, I've only played her for 3 hours, 29 games played, 22 games won with her. I have a 78% win rate. So I have a better win rate with Kiriko than I do with D.Va, which is crazy. Uh, game reports... Like, yeah, so, like, I've won a lot of, lot of games. Oh, okay, I, I lost one game, um, and that was uh, two days ago. Um, but I wish I could see, like, uh, uh, there you go. I wish I could see, like, the 26, you might be wondering, that is from... Uh, before it switched over to Overwatch 2. So that was my original level that I ended up with at the end of Overwatch 1 moving into Overwatch 2. And the 3 just means the um, the endorsement level I'm at. Um, but I wish there was a way that I could see like achievements. There was a way that you used to be able to see like achievements um, in in this but I guess you can't now view career I guess you can't really see your achievements um, like because you used to be able to go through and see like what achievements you're missing and stuff like that like if I pull this up for example and go to here right like you can still do all of this stuff, right? It's saying that I only have nine achievements. Right? Like, the last achievement I got was last year. But I've had some from, like, 2019 and beyond, past. It's just weird that you can't actually um, see the... Um, see the... Oops, that's not what I wanted. See everything. So... Um, I'm actually going to do something which I never really do, and that is actually uh, do this, sign out, sign out, and I'm going to jump into Overwatch, hopefully, on a third account, because I want to actually see what, shall we say, a, news, a new player's experience would be um, for Overwatch, um, if it will allow me. Um, I'm not sure if it will allow me. Um, let's see. 
Um, it might not allow me. Because the account that we were playing on is my main account, the one I've had for since 2017. Um, Xbox, are you okay? Okay, there we go. Um, let's see. Yeah. Uh, okay. It might not allow me to. T uh, yeah. Oh, bummer. Okay. Uh, Hold on, choose user. Okay. That's, that's annoying. That's, that's annoying where you can't actually, um, you can only run one account. Okay. That's fine. It is what it is. Um, how long have we been going for? We've been going for an hour. Okay. Um, I, I do want to show you guys something. Um, so. We're jumping into Forza Horizons 2. And this game, ironically, um, it's still playable. It is, um, still playable. And I've actually earned uh, a few achievements. Um, so, this is another game we, we will, I will be playing on the channel, uh, in the next little bit. But I just wanted to show you that, um... Uh, what cars I have and then we'll jump back into overwatch um, I don't have a lot of cars in in Forza Horizon 2 I do have more cars in Forza Horizons 3 uh, Considering I've been playing that game on and off for years. I'm still going to probably go back to over uh, uh, Forza Horizons 3 at some point um, Will I be buying motorsport the new one probably not um I, I probably will buy the next um, Horizon, probably. It's saying my favorite car is the Z4. Eh, it's not that bad of a car. Ooh, wheel spin. Let's see what we got. Thirty thousand. That's not bad. So if I go here into the, uh, yeah, so if I go into garage, oh, you can't see actually how much credit I have. So there you go. I have 138,160, sorry, 1,000, sorry, 138,154. Um, that's what I meant. So we have the Lamborghini Team Forza Huracan LP610-4, which is a $300,000 car. It was free. Uh, we have the DBS, $270,000 car. It was free. The R8, which is one of my favorite cars in life. Um, problem is, I have sat in it um, a few years ago. I don't fit into it comfortably, considering I'm quite tall. I'm about 6 to 6'1". Six Um, so it's a $150,000 car. We have the M5, which was free. It's a $98,000 car. 
Z4, which was the first car I picked. Uh, we have the 458 Italia. Again, a really, really nice car. I tried to go for the Ferrari Red, but unfortunately didn't really um, suit it. I might end up trying to change that color. Um, $238,000 car. Again, all these cars that I'm showing you were free. Uh, $160,000 uh, Challenge Strada. Uh, Strada Day. So we're talking F430 here, basically. And then we have the Ferrari 330 P4 from 1967. So this is the, I think it was a Le Mans car, I think, if I remember correctly. And that was 2.3 million. But luckily, all of these cars, like I said, are free. Um, but obviously, I love the, uh, the Lamborghini uh, Huracan LP610-4. Because if I remember correctly, it is... I think it's a V12 engine, I believe. Let me look that up. Um, because I th I think it was... Um, um, I think it's a V12, I think. Yeah, uh, 610-4... Oh, okay, so it's a V10, not a V12. Okay. Okay. For some reason, I thought it was a V12, but I guess it was a V10. So we're going to just rev the thing just a, a little bit. Um, I tried to make it the orange that the Lamborghinis normally are. Oops. Uh... There we go. Uh, is there, oops, wrong button. Is there a way I can do like, uh, where is it? So there's the bucket list of the speed zone stuff. Uh, there's the horizon stuff here. Okay, uh, there's, I thought there was a way I can zoom. Okay, so this is the entire map. So there's a golf course way up there. Um, the modern supercar. Uh, I wish it was like a, a track here. Um, where I could actually, I know in the, okay, uh, this is all the bucket list stuff. Um, I know in I know in the third game uh, there's like a um, there we go I just had to uh, figure out what Yeah, I, I, I don't know why. I just love doing donuts. I wish um, after a while um, your tires would pop. Um, I did uh, set this up to be um, a manual gearbox. Um, because that's what I typically use in all uh, Forza games. Um, let's try.
try out doing the doing that same thing with the uh, with this car. I, I know it's not a, a really a good idea, but again, it's a video game, so who cares? Um, back. So we're talking back out here. So, oh, okay, so it's, uh, okay, so we're talking, uh, right-hand drive. Uh, probably not a good idea to, uh, to do it over here. Let's let's do it over here, where there's a little bit more space. Uh, let's back up a little bit. Throw it into first, and then. This thing is pretty darn quick as well. And granted, I am sh short shifting it. Uh, where typically I would like to um, sort of get up to about nine grand. Okay. I'm just... Jeez. Oof. Ooh, that's not good. So let's just... I need a... F yeah. Like... Like I said, I typically don't like short shifting the 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 vehicle, even though it is, shall we say, a sort of a, a sim. I don't like doing it because it's not really. Oh yeah, you can you you can short shift these. Is it ideal? No. It is sort of hard to control as well. So we're for fourth gear. I really need it to be on a like a straight road or something. Oh wow! I'm s okay. Uh, give me a sec here. I actually need to plug in the controller. It's almost dead. There we go. Uh, let's drop it to first gear. Okay.
Oof. If you guys want, I can just screw around in fours if you guys really want. Either in Forza Horizons 2, Forza Horizons 3, um... Oh, I could definitely do some Gymkhana stuff in this. Um, I could do it, yeah. But anyways, uh, let's get back to um, Overwatch, shall we? Uh, probably one more game and then... Um, that'll be it for the uh, video. Um, I'll be, uh, back in one sec. Anyways, we're back. So, let's just jump into... Um, let's see what Hero Mastery there is right now. Ah, oh, okay. So, it's only those four right now. Sorry, those five. Um, I definitely want to do the Hero uh, Mastery for D.Va. Uh, considering I do play a fair bit of uh, D.Va. But... Um, hmm, what challenges do I have? Uh, so all roles, three as a group, a limbs with ultimate excludes total mayhem and co-op. Okay, oh, comp let's just get the competitive one out of the way. Uh, open queue. I typically don't play a lot of um, competitive just because it's annoying. The only time I do it is for like challenges. Um, and then I can put myself, I guess I can put myself like there, I guess. Oh, okay, so I'm in silver. Basically. Oh, uh, we already have a diva, okay. Now I guess I'll try a Ramada. I think I have that skin for Diva. I th I think I have that skin. I have to check that to see if I have that skin. Uh, 
do we have any healers? Yes, we do. We have one healer, two damage, and a ta and two tanks. Okay, uh, hmm. Uh, let's do... I guess I'll just run... Oh! Okay. Uh... So I guess that's going to be it, I guess, unfortunately. So a little bit of Overwatch uh, and a little bit of Forza. Um, so if you guys want, I'm definitely going to be doing a lot more uh, Overwatch over the next uh, little bit. Um, so yeah, maybe on console, maybe PC, I'm not sure. Uh, but I am definitely going to be doing a lot more of the um, the Halloween stuff. Um, like, uh, like I'm so close on f getting all through all of it. Um, if we go into challenges, um, it's going to be a bit of a freaking grind. Like, here's all the competitive stuff. Like... Like, no thank you. Like, I did win 50 games and stuff like that. But, like, no, I'm not going to be doing any of this stuff, really. Like, it's ridiculous. Like, if I go to the event stuff, yeah, like, I'm going to try to finish as much as I can of the event stuff. Like, some of these, like I said, that's going to be a pain, that's going to be a pain, that's a pain. I think I've done that uh, last season, last year, and that's going to be a pain. Like, that's not going to be that bad. Uh, wins uh, Dungeon Deliverer, um, or that's not going to be that bad. That's not going to be that bad. Um, that's just going to take some time, that's going to take some time, that's going to take some time. That's definitely going to take some time, but I've done 10 of them already. Uh, there's one here. Which one was it? Um, that These two were from last season. Uh, Photosom and Wrath of the Bride. Those ones were done uh, last year, but for some reason, um, they just showed up again. Um, so, yeah. Um... And once the, um, uh, Hero Mastery for, for D.Va shows up, uh, you know I'm going to be grinding the crap out of that. Um, so yeah, so, like I said, hoping to get to at least level 10, um, this week. Um, like, I'm hoping to get the bow pass, but we'll see what happens. Um, that's not that bad of a skin for, um, for Wrecking Ball. There's not a lot for D.Va, ironically, in this season. Or season's pass, unfortunately. 
um, or at least from what I can tell. That's a nice uh, spray, actually. Uh, that's really nice. Um, which almost looks like Rayquaza, actually. That's not bad. If I can get to that by in 53 days, which is possible, that would be a nice one to have. Um, the that that's a really nice Echo skin. Reminds me of something out of um, Alice in Wonderland. Um, Madness Returns, which, by the way, I do have that game finally. Um, I did a video on that. Um, Tea Time emote. That's not a bad emote, actually. Um, that's a really nice um, um, name card. <laughs> Moon Raven, which is a reference to Edgar Allan Poe's Raven, I'm betting. A reference to it. Uh, Cursed Warrior Doom. That's not a bad one. Um, um, that's a nice uh, Dolomari player icon. That's nice. Um, that's 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 a nice um, spray as well. Um, skin for Ramada. That's not bad. Um, Widowmaker Decay intro. That's not bad. Um, what else is a nice one? The victory pose for uh, Cassidy. Um, fear, no fury. That's a nice um, one. Uh, that's not bad. Um, the handmade doll. Kind of creepy, actually. Uh, Crimson Clown. Ooh, that's nice, but that's going to be a grind. Um, so, anyways. And then we have the mythic uh, Hanzo. So, yeah. Anyways, that's going to be it. Bye-bye.